Hey guys, I hope you're all doing really well. So today I have a very exciting video. I recently picked up a few things online from Cezanne. I've been a huge fan of the brand Cezanne for a long time. They're a French brand and they have very good sustainable ethos. So I really wanted to share with you a few pieces that I picked up that I absolutely love. The price range in Cezanne is that little bit more expensive. So you have to sort of carefully think about what you want to buy which is good because that's a much more sustainable way to shop so i'm going to get straight in with the haul and show you what i'm wearing i also picked up a few accessories so i'll show you after this outfit um, the accessories that i picked up so i fell very much in love with this little mini dress that i'm wearing it's in the most gorgeous like rusty pink check got really beautiful gathered details at the front and the back. And then this is what the length of the dress looks like. I have a very needy cat with me here. <laughs> and it's got this wrap around skirt section here, but it's covered completely with an actual skirt. So I usually don't like wrap skirts because I feel very on show, but this one, you're completely covered. And then the back is just plain, um, gathered at the back and just a nice, mini skirt length and I've paired it with my brown boots from Mango. I've been living in these boots recently, they were such a good purchase. I'm not sure if they still do them on Mango but I can have a look and I'll find a link to anything similar if I do find them because they are just so comfy and they keep your legs nice and warm so it's perfect if you're not really wanting to wear tights yet. And then I've also been loving my Todd's bag recently which also kind of goes with the boots. So I feel like this is my perfect little autumn, warm autumn day outfit. <laughs> yeah, let me know what you guys think of this dress. Should I keep it? Should I send it back? I feel like I really love it and I just love all the little details like the little brown buttons really add something else to the construction of it. I'm going to show you the accessories I picked up next because some of them might go with this outfit. We'll see. <laughs> so the first little accessory I've got are their oversized, I think they're called the Charlie earrings, I'm not sure, um, but I've wanted these for so long and they are just pretty amazing. I just was worried that they'd really hurt my ears. Um, I haven't tried them on yet, but what do we think? Do we like them? <laughs> I think they're pretty cool and they make quite a statement. And also I'm just loving my hair just tied up and out the way at the moment. And so this really helps sort of dress up an outfit. I think they go with this outfit pretty well. The only thing is you can kind of hear them wiggling around. <laughs> but they are pretty cool and they come in so many different colors. So if you don't like pink, then they come in like green, yellow, all sorts of colors. The next accessory I picked up was a belt. Now they have such good belts on their website, but they are quite expensive. Um, so if I'm not totally in love with this, I'm not gonna keep it, but it's a pretty amazing belt. It's this nice brown leather and I think I got the smallest size and it's the right size for me. Now the only thing is it really only can go around your waist because it doesn't seem to work around hips. So yeah, I'll try this on properly with a different outfit, but that's the giant belt. <laughs> I do love how chunky it is. It's just super, super duper chunky. And I have lots of accessories in this sort of tone of leather so it would go with my bags and everything like that so yeah i'll try that on when i've got the next dress on maybe and then the final accessory i picked up is one of their quilted bags this is like a weekend bag and i have been lusting over this for a long time and i thought i'm gonna try it and now i really want to keep it <laughs> such a good giant size of a bag and it will be really great for going away for the weekend and it's just a very pretty bag. Like, I love this print so much. It's a very pretty bag. And we all know I love a bit of quilting. So, yeah, very happy with this. I could have made myself a bag like this, but I think by the time I'd have made it and had nice fabric like this, it would have probably been more expensive to make it than to buy it. So, yes. 
I was going to show you the next dress, but I think I'm going to show you the piece of knitwear that I picked up first because I can wear this on top of this dress. So I feel like Suzanne knitwear is just next level knitwear. No other brand seems to do them quite the same. And the fibre content is just always so spot on. Like this looks like it's a mohair jumper, but it's super soft and not itchy at all. I'm not sure what's actually in this. It could be alpaca maybe. Okay, so it's baby alpaca, polyamide and elastane. A good mix for my skin, because then it's not too itchy. I love alpaca jumpers. They're always so soft and warm. Um, but this one I thought was absolutely gorgeous. It's in this really deep green shade and it's got buttons at the front. And I picked this up in a size small. Oh, I really didn't want to like this. <laughs> love it, it's so cozy. And I just love this sort of neckline. I, if I get really cold, I could do it all the way up. Oh, it's really nice. This is the sort of green I don't mind with my red hair. There's a lot of greens out there that I'm like, Meh, no. Um, but everyone's always like, oh, wear green with red hair. Back of the jumper is just plain. So it's nice and simple, but just gorgeous with this detailing around the neckline. I'm in the next dress now. I just took the earrings out because I didn't think they really went with this blue dress. I'm a little bit in two minds about this dress because I absolutely love the neckline and everything that's going on here, but I feel like the skirt part is a little bit boring. <laughs> I'm pairing it with these boots from Clark's, which I actually picked up recently. And they are the comfiest heeled boots I've ever owned. They are in this really gorgeous dark, dark brown. And I'm going to style this dress with my Chloe bag, going for very dark brown accessories this time. I absolutely love this sort of lace detailing around the neckline. It's really just makes it look casual and easy breezy. But let me just show you the length of the dress. So it's pretty long. Um, I'd say it's probably a maxi dress on me. And I'm like five, seven, eight-ish. And yeah, I just, like I love this dress, but I just think this bottom part is a little bit more on the boring side. Um, so let me just try it on with the belt. So yeah, if you're any smaller than me in the waist, um, then this might not fit all that great because it's a little bit, and you're a tiny bit loose, like I wouldn't want it any tighter. So there we go, that is the belt, it's pretty cool. And I think that adds a lot more to the dress. Um, a lot of their styling is done with belts on Cezanne on the website. So yeah, I definitely prefer it with the belt. But I don't know if this dress is for me, to be honest. I think if I were a little bit older, I'd have maybe kept the dress. But if it's between this one and the pink one, I would definitely choose the pink one for now because I just think it's so, it's just so me. <laughs> but this is a really gorgeous dress. And if you're looking for something like this, then I would highly recommend it. It's in a really gorgeous, very lightweight cotton. So very breathable. So the final item I have is this beautiful blouse. Again, very blue. <laughs> There's something about this color, now that it's arrived, that is sort of triggering me to school. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it just is. <laughs> um, but again, it's got the same neckline as the dress did, and I just love it so much. I love how it can go up high, or you can just have it relaxed like this. And then I just styled it with my flare jeans, so super casual. And yeah, it's just a very nice blouse. I feel like you could wear this super casually or you could wear it to work if you work in an office. <laughs> the cuffs are really beautifully constructed. They're nice and tight on the wrist, obviously not too tight. But again, let me know what you guys think of this blouse down in the comments below. And also let me know which item was your favorite? I think mine has to be the pink dress or the green jumper. I'm not sure. I do also love the bag. <laughs> I hope you guys have really enjoyed this. As always, I will link everything in the description bar down below. I hope you're having a great day and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.